Hello my crafty friends, it's Krista here from Second Chance Creation. I thought I'd do a very quick share um, of my entry. It's going to the USA, so by the time you see this, um, it's pretty well on its way. And um, it's run by Laurie from Girl on the Ridge. Um, they, um, Laurie and Maggie White have a, a live every Wednesday here in Australia time so it's Tuesday night over there and um, when I, whenever I can I craft with them and um, we have a lot of laughs last couple of weeks I haven't been able to but um, I thought I'd better make a video just to share with you and what they're and what it is it's we send a page in of um, what we'd like a business to be in a little town called craft rule there is no stress just lots of fun and yeah and a bit of work thrown in and um, the town is overrun by handsome cowboys so we're always on the lookout for that special one so my story is that um, I'm M Tibbets and they call me M for short and I'm be running an op I'm opening and running um, the stables called Fashion Stables. So I get to see firsthand who comes in, and um, yeah, so I've got a better chance of um, catching the a cowboy's eye. So I've used snippets from magazines and um, bits and pieces from my stash. I found a lot of these from magazines and then I had a Reader's Digest that I opened up the other day and I found this name M Tibbets and I thought how cool is that so that's what I'll be called in Craftsville M Tibbets I've got some black um, corrugated cardboard just here which is from a um, takeaway coffee cup or well, it's a dark chocolate brown I think um, used a bit of um, hessian or burlap fabric and some jeans because I'll be in my jeans and covered in dust during the day but at night time I'll be in a frilly dress and in bows smelling like a rose as you open it up um, I've got a page here and there you'll see me all dressed up and of course I've made this little tag um, old weathered belt and some letters and M wanted no reminder of realities and responsibilities and that's why she moved to Craftville in the USA. At times she'll sit at the window keeping a lookout for that rider, cowboy, coachman. So this is um, a picture from a Reader's Digest and I just cut out the window and layered it with a curtain behind it just to make it a bit realistic. And of course, you know, the time representing at times that she sits at the windowsill um, watching them go by. Just looking for that brave and handsome fella. And she's also waiting for a dress she sent away and she received a little swatch. And she's um, waiting for the dressmaker to make her a special dress with a particular lace and some um, ribbon. And this is the fabric and some pearl trim. And of course, um, you know, I've just made that from bits of scraps and a bit of corrugated um, cardboard representing the view of the window. On the back, I've made a belly band from um, the painted paper towels that my friend gifted me. And the sweet story, and this gives um, Laurie a bit of an insight of um, M that's moving to Craftville. A little photo of M when she was a young child um, where the love of horses started and of course I just used some um, this was a paper bag and I just grunged it, tore it in half, grunged it up covered it with um, um, coffee dyed tulle and inside I've made a letter so that um, when Laurie reads it she knows a little bit about um, M Tibbets and it reads, hello, my name is M Tibbets. Everyone just calls me M. My love of horses started at an early age. 
I travelled from Australia to become the new owner of Fashion Stables here in Craftville, a town I heard a lot of whispers about, the no-stress lifestyle and the handsome cowboys. During the day, you'll see me in jeans and covered in dust, looking after the horses. But at night, you'll catch a glimpse of me in a frilly dress and bows, smelling like a rose. Kicking up my heels in the saloon. At times, I sit at the window in the hope to catch a glimpse of the cowboy of my dreams to join me in my new venture. And because this letter is pretty well crumbled up, I had to explain and apologise for the state of this letter. My horse decided to give it a taste test. Signed, M. So this gives um, Laurie then a bit of an idea, the background of M. Tibbetts, who'll be running the fashion stables in Craftville in the USA in the early 1800s, I believe about 1820s or 1830s. So thanks um, for the opportunity and it's definitely on its way. That's all I wanted to share and I'm going to leave um, Laurie's channel link in the description box as well and Maggie White's so if you don't know or haven't heard about them please pop over and check them out and usually you can catch Laurie's live they do it in alternate um, weeks one week it's Maggie one week it's Laurie and um, it sort of starts around 10ish here Wednesday mornings Australian time until then you know what you've got to do Happy crafting. Bye for now.